and C, remember what we talked about. Remember I asked you guys for the patterns. What, the, when you guys are doing the patterns, this first term starts at the highest, right? It starts at that same power, right? Last one we did, X to, we did to the fourth power. It started X to the fourth. So automatically what I'm going to do is I'm just going to create a set of binomials. Um, sorry. I'm going to create a set of binomials. So I know that my first term is X to the fifth, 5 to the 0, right? Well, we're using 5 instead of y this time. Then I'm going to have plus x to the fourth, 5 to the first, plus x cubed, 5 squared, plus x squared, 5 cubed, plus x, 5 to the fourth, plus <coughs> x to the 0, 5 to the fifth. Does everybody see how I at least spread that out? All I did was the ascending, descending. To me, that is the easiest thing to understand, is the ascending, descending. Now, the next portion, and again, also remember guys, x to the 0 is 1, 5 to the 0 is 1. So they really don't be, but I like to write them in there so I remember this. Um, the next example is, this is raised to the fifth power. So I go down on my fifth row on the Pascal's triangle, and I realize that the coefficients are going to be 1, 5, 10, 10, 10, 10, 5, and 1. Now again, these are all multiplied. Does everybody see that? Yes? I don't know, why'd you add, why'd you add that one? Where? Yeah, no, I haven't simplified it though yet. Oh. 5 to the 0 is 1, so therefore I can just rewrite this as x to the 5th. This is becomes 5 to the 1st is really 5, but 5 times 5 is 25, x to the 4th. Plus here, I have x cubed, this is 5 squared. 5 squared times 10 is 250x cubed. Here I have 5 to the 3rd power, which is 125 times 10 which is going to be 125, 0, x squared. 5 to the fourth power is going to be 625. Uh, and then I'll just need to multiply it by 5 one more time, which is 3,125, x. And then x to the 0 is, um, x to the 0 is just 1, so then it's 5 to the fifth power. Wait a minute, yeah, I did that right? Yeah, okay x to the fifth power, which is again is plus 3,125. Okay? All right, we're going to do one more example when you guys return.